In today's video, we're going to learn how to create a Kylo Ren voice effect in Premiere Pro CC. This is how to film a YouTube video or anything. Now, this week I have a little bit of a cold, so my uh, voice is a little bit hoarse. And I thought, well, maybe I can't really do a video this week. But then I thought, no, what better time than to do a Kylo Ren voice tutorial when your voice is already a little bit hoarse. So let's go ahead and get started. We're in Premiere Pro CC, and we are just going to use the built-in audio effects, so we don't need to go into Audio Edition or any specialized audio uh, software to do this. We're just going to do it all in CC. Let's go ahead and double-click here, bring in our file, and let's go ahead and drag it down to the timeline. Okay, now since we're only working with audio, I'm going to go ahead and make this bigger. And let's just take a listen to it. You will give in to the dark side of the Force. You will join the First Order. You will like and share this video. You will comment. You will subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you will come back every Monday to watch new videos. Okay, that's working pretty good. Some of that feedback you heard is not on my file. That is me kind of messing with this microphone here. Uh, let me turn it down a bit. Okay, so I have my computer audio coming through the speakers as well as the microphone. And that's why you're getting all this craziness. Okay, the first thing we want to do is I'm going to go ahead and bring up the audio effects. So click effects down here in this corner, find audio effects, open it up, and let's go ahead and put a vocal enhancer on there. And that's just going to kind of help everything out, kind of give in to the dark side, start to clarify a little bit. And we're also going to put on a multiband compressor. And that is right here. So drag that onto your footage. And then on the multiband compressor, that is kind of to just even out uh, the audio, the, the loud points and the soft points. And you can just go ahead and use the, the default. Well, I'll go ahead and use the settings that I'm using. I'm going to change the gain to minus six because some of the filters we're going to put on there are going to start to, uh, you know, increase the volume. And so we're going to compensate that for that ahead of time. Uh, let's make the threshold negative four, the margin negative four. Go ahead and click brick wall limiter and let's link the band controls. Now on the threshold, let's change that to negative 14 and you'll see that it spreads across all the bands since they're all linked. And let's change the ratio to four to one. Okay, go ahead and close that out and you can well, we can listen to it and see what it's sounding like. We'll give in to the dark side of the force. Now you can't tell too much difference already. Uh, now we're going to start to get more of a Kylo Ren effect. Now Adam Driver has a pretty low voice. And so uh, even though I have uh, somewhat of a low voice, his is still down there. So we're going to take a pitch shifter and we're going to put that on our footage. And now up here in the effect controls, we'll go ahead and open that up the controls up for pitch shifter and you can kind of play with it um, let's go down to negative five and see what that does you will join the first order you will like and share this video okay so that's starting to sound kind of Kylo Ren-ish maybe I'll back it off just a little and let's change the precision to medium precision try to keep a little bit more clarity you'll notice everything about Kylo Ren is kind of fuzzy it's kind of off his uh you know, from his uh, helmet, it's a little bit dented. His uh, his clothing's kind of frayed. Even his uh, lightsaber is uh, kind of jaggedy and lightning lightning lightningy. Is that a word? It's like lightning. It's not real smooth like the old Jedi's. And he, so even his voice is kind of raspy and and ragged. And so that's what we're trying to emulate here. Now you're uh, you may not be going for an exact Kylo Ren match. If you are, depending on your voice, you may have to drop the pitch more or uh, play around a little bit. But, uh, you know, you're probably trying to make a uh, your own version of Kylo Ren as if you became Kylo Ren. And then so you want it to sound like you, but also Kylo Ren-ish. 
And so that's kind of what we're playing with here. Let's go ahead and see. Let's listen to this one more time. You will give in to the dark side of the force. You will join the first order. Okay. Now we're starting to get there. Let's do one more thing. We're going to put on one more filter, and it is called Guitar Suite. So go ahead and grab Guitar Suite. That puts it into the effect controls. And the default comes as uh, there's some presets. Big and dumb is the pre. That's the preset that would probably work. But we're gonna go for Driven Box. So go ahead and switch it to Driven Box. Now you'll see some of these uh, controls have bypass uh, clicked, and that means it's just skipping over that. It's not using it. So let's unclick all the bypasses so we get all our effects in play. And let's go ahead and start changing some of these a little bit. Let's change the filter to, well, let's, let's change it to, <laughs> well, let's go ahead and leave the filter on retro, see what that does. Um, garage fuzz, let's bump that up a little bit. Let's change the amplifier to clean American jazz. And let's also drop the amount to about 80%. Okay, let's go ahead and take a listen to what we're getting so far here. Give in to the dark side of the force. You will join the first order. You will like and share this video. Okay, that's pretty good. We're getting right there. You can go ahead and play with some of these controls, uh, depending how much clarity you need. Uh, you know, I think Adam Driver probably spent his whole childhood in acting classes learning how to enunciate and speak clearly for the screen and then he gets a role in Star Wars and they put this filter on his voice so you can hardly understand him so it seems like kind of a waste but you know if we want people to not understand us and mumble then we can be on the dark side give in to the dark dark side of the force okay <laughs> You will give in to the dark side of the force. You will join the first order. You will like and share this video. Yeah, now I'm kind of liking that pretty well. Um, I might go. You can go back and revisit some of the things. I think I'll go back to the pitch shifter and drop it just a little lower. You will comment. You will subscribe to my YouTube channel. And then let's go ahead and go back to the guitar suite. And uh, for the most part, though, we're there. We can... Uh, you can kind of monkey with these a little bit. But let's go ahead and listen to what we got. You will give in to the dark side of the force. You will join the First Order. You will like and share this video. You will comment. You will subscribe to my YouTube channel, and you will come back every Monday to watch new videos. All right, that'll wrap it up for this week. I'm Jeff McClellan. This is Grasshopper Cinema and how to film a YouTube video or anything. Remember, I really do appreciate it if you like, share, comment, and subscribe. So uh, keep on keeping on. We'll see you next Monday.